I was driving through my little old town and that scrapyard is the scrapyard that I worked at when I was like 14. Every day for lunch, I'd walk right up here to this Dairy Queen and get like a Hunger Buster Jr. and a small milkshake for two bucks. I was always embarrassed because I'd be so dirty in that restaurant, but I was hungry and it gave me a chance to sit in the air conditioner before I had to go back to work in the heat. Then I got fired because I was only 14. By the time I was old enough to get a real job, this new pizza place had opened in town. I wanted to be one of the cool kids and work at the pizza place, so I go in there and try to get a job. The owner of the pizza place was like, hey, aren't you that dirty little kid that used to come in the Dairy Queen every day at lunch? I was the manager, I remember you. Just like that, all the embarrassment I'd ever felt sitting in that restaurant had resurfaced because I'd been recognized as the dirty kid that sat in the restaurant. I was thinking, well, I'm not good enough to work here. He knows who I am. But he said, you know, I saw you every single day, so I know you'll show up for work. You were the dirtiest person I saw every single day, so I know you'll work. If I could hire 20 more people just like you, I would. That was the last time I ever felt embarrassed about having to get dirty for work. Because you never know who's watching your hustle, and you never know what opportunities will come of it.